All right. Hello, everybody. I'm back again uh, with another one of my favorite programs. I'm going to try to keep this one real short. Um, Rocket Dock. And what it does is it makes your uh, your screen look similar to that of a Mac system. You know, I'm, I, I'm one of those people, like I said, I love organization. I hate messiness. I hate all that additional crap that pops up on your screen. So um, I found this little program. I think it's really neat. I'm going to go through a couple of the quick features and also let you know where you can look. So like I said, um, what you can do, open up your red web browser. You can pop open this bad boy like this here. Go to rocketdoc.com. Um, there's a couple of variation sites where you can download it. There, there's a myriad of different places you can go to get it. But I, I'm one of those people that like to go directly to the website. Um, right here up the top left, you can click on it there and it, it'll open up and let you download all the information. It also has an, an about area. That's the screen that I'm on now. It'll go and give you a quick little breakdown of what it is. Uh, a quick video that's not as good and beautiful as mine. It'll go through all the features and it uh, just lets you know that this is a free software. You're not stealing it from anything. Um, I hate to go off course a little bit, but uh, Rocket Doc, uh, it also has, it, it's basically uh, a, a place where you can go through and look up information for uh, icons and skins and so forth. When you click on that Get Add-ons area, then you can go through and you can look at some of the different cool little icons they have here just something that may be able to be user friendly or just something that's just real interesting for you to check out alright I know you're like alright where, where is it at I have came here to look at the program not to listen to you talk alright check it out uh, down here at the bottom I have it on the auto high feature it'll pop up like magic um, it comes with the real real basic icons and programs like there are pictures, music, documents, network, my computer, control panel, and so forth. But you can add basically any icon, any shortcut onto it. You know, for mine, I have, you know, of course, email. Any computer guy has to go with the email, your internet browsers. Um, some of the, the software that I use most often, you know, it, it, it's a pretty neat program to check out. Like I said, it, it's kind of like a little bubble, and it works the same way that the Mac system works. You can also adjust various features within the programs. If you click on Dock Settings, you'll get a little uh, a little box that pops up right here. You can go into the icons and change for it to start at run up. You can minimize it on the dock. You can uh, lock the items where people can't add or subtract them. You can make changes and adjustments to the icons. You can make them low quality or high quality the only difference is you know the clarity of them you know it doesn't matter how clear they are you know I want to minimize the uh, the time that it takes to load you can adjust the opacity you know you can make it to where it's really clear to where it's really really visible down at the bottom you can change the size of each of the individuals icons make it as big as small as you want I won't go through all of them but really cool uh, changes you can make to it you can also adjust the position. I like mine down at the bottom just so to kind of emulate what the Mac system does. Uh, but, you know, some people like it at the top. If you look at my screen, it's a little unusual. I have the taskbar at the, at the top and nothing at the bottom because really I don't use this that too much. I'm more down here on the bottom. Um, you can also adjust the style. If you look, uh, you can change it, make it different colors, different little shapes, and, you know everybody has their own little preference I like to keep it nice and simple real real clean looking you can also adjust the outline of the opacity the shadow uh, you can change the behavior how everything does react um, and also anytime there's an update there's an update feature at the top so hopefully that didn't take too much of your time that's just a little overview of what was it again dock rocket so uh check it out pretty good uh, items hope you enjoyed it thanks